WFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien, coming to you live from TFNN, 11 a.m. Eastern Time. We go an hour and a half into the trading day, and we got markets accelerating to the downside, giving back some of the gains of last Friday. Negative yet again following the extension of yesterday. We get the S&Ps negative by about eight tenths percent. You're negative by 35 points, just under 41.80, 41.79. The S&Ps, Nasdaq 100 down about six tenths percent, negative by 87 points at 14,313. Dow off eight tenths percent, 32,823. And the Russell leading the way. Russell man off 1.6 percent. You're off 28 points in the Russell at 17.42. As our man Basil Chapman would say, just finished up his program. The day is young, and Basil was talking about it, folks. Check out his online event for the Boston. Investors Group. I posted a link to it in the Tiger Stand. If you haven't joined the Tiger Stand, folks, come check it out at the front page of TFNN. Should be an exciting event at 7 o'clock. Anytime you can listen to our man Basil Chapman speak, I encourage you to check it out. Gold contract up about $11, $19.88 right now. We got some action in gold. We got some action in currencies. We jump over to the dollar index. Excuse me. DXY. Look at that volatility, man. Both directions, right? Dollar index down to 104.2. Up to 104.60, we're back at 104.50 right now in the dollar index. You jump over to the 10-year, you get the 10-year right now. <coughs> Excuse me. Up nine ticks at 114.10. We jump over to the VIX as we get some negative action. VIX basically pushing the highs of yesterday at 18.13. A lot happening today. We have a debt limit vote. We got jobs numbers on Friday. That's the number that really I'm looking forward to. See a lot of risk to the downside with the market of 4,200, folks. I talk about it, talked about it on my program this morning. Core PCE, inflation numbers, they're not going to where the Fed wants them to go, man. We got a Fed meeting from two weeks from today. Very difficult to my, my, in my mind to imagine that they will actually be pausing. Remarkable to say that as we continue to go forward, but nonetheless, that's the case. Now, coming up next hour, folks. So William O'Neill, the founder of Investors Business Daily, he passed away this weekend. Uh, founded Investors Business Daily in 1984. He was 90 years old. We were fortunate at TFNN to have a partnership with IBD years back where my dad, Tom O'Brien, would bring on William O'Neill, would call it the Ask Bill program on TFNN. They would run some ads in their newspaper promoting it. Bill would come on for the hour, would take questions by email, by call for the hour. So what we're going to do, folks, is we're going to replay the last time that happened. Remarkable. 2014, man. Uh, April 17th, 2014. So that's the program that'll be coming up on Tiger TV. I encourage you to check it out in memory of Mr. William O'Neill from IBD. Uh, Ask Bill on TFNN from April 17, 2014. A few things have changed since then, including the set at TFNN. Thanks so much, folks. Stay tuned. Uh, live programming coming up after that. Have a great Wednesday, everybody.